How's it going everybody? Welcome back to Manti Gaming. So it's been a while since I've made a video, I realize that, but I found a lot of cool stuff that I want to be able to share with you guys. Um, also, I'm really, I'm going to be traveling soon. It's actually a really strange time for me to start like, you know, jumping back into making a lot of videos. Um, but uh, I, you know, when you get the inspiration, you just kind of have to do it. I know if I, if I waited, then it wouldn't happen. But anyway, tomorrow I fly out for the Netherlands. Um, I do plan on making some video content during that time. So Check it out when it comes out. Be sure to hit that subscribe button. That way you guys can check out the new videos when they come out because they're going to be coming out pretty soon. Also, they are almost all going to be like money making related. So if you guys are looking for some money making guides and stuff like that, that's the kind of stuff I'm going to be posting while I'm on that trip. Um, so right now, uh, I've got something cool I want to show you guys I actually discovered today, which is pretty sweet. And uh, when I saw it, I got I, honestly, I was really excited. I was like, holy cow, this is like the coolest thing I've seen in a while. So anyway, let's jump right on into it. I've already talked too much. So here we go. Enjoying some coffee way too late in the night, but it's what you got to do sometimes. So right here we've got uh, all of these Elder Rune items. I'll move this over a little bit, that way you can see it. Um, but as you can see right here, we've got the Elder Rune plate body, two-end sword, armor, boots, blah, 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 blah. Everything in this Grand Exchange is uh, the Elder Rune plus zero items. So what we're going to be doing with these Elder Rune things is... Um, honestly, when I first looked at them, I was like, what's the best thing to do with these? And then I just kind of figured it out, uh, based on the prices of, uh, what the alchemy prices of these things are and what the prices you could instant buy, instant sell them for. And then I realized just kind of click right there. I was like, holy cow, this is a really great opportunity. So what this, what this video is about, and it's kind of, it's kind of, I don't know, it's kind of confusing. I'll, I'll, I'll explain it as we go. So just bear with me and try to watch the entire thing. But, um, it is a super safe overnight investing opportunity, overnight flipping opportunity um, that you can do with a very low amount of money as well because these items are, are fairly cheap. Um, I always get people asking me, hey, Manti Game, what do I flip with 10 million, 20 million, 30 million? And most of the time my answer is, uh, well, honestly, just like start with some things you can afford, but then focus mostly on Slayer and stuff like that. Um, with this right here, you can uh, start making some money flipping and using that money that you have, even if it is a lower amount of money. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump on into it. So right here, we've got Elder Rune Plate Bodies. So Elder Rune Plate Body um, is an item that has a eye alchemy value of right around, I think it is 50,000. You know what? We're going to actually gonna go check. So I actually have up on here too. Uh, to show you guys well the uh the internet window <laughs> the internet window guys um this right here is a full list of all of the items that you can make with elder rune bars you can simply find this by just searching for elder rune bars in the wiki you guys should really honestly dig in the wiki like whenever you're like trying to figure out things for profit and stuff like that start with the wiki it's a really great resource you know obviously it has everything in here um i'll put the link for the wiki in the description down below to this exact page that way you can guys can use this um but right here when we, dig, when we dig through, let's go find Elder Rune Plate Body and I'll show you, I'll kind of show you what I'm talking about here. So as you can see right here, it takes five Elder Rune bars to make one of these Elder Rune Plate Bodies. If we open up in a new tab here and go over here, um, then we see that our Elder Rune Plate Body High Alchemy, there we go, is 50,000 gold. So right over here, it's like, here, let me move my, move my head out of the way. I was kind of weird because I'm like, if I put myself here or on this side of the screen, yeah, it was, just, it was kind of difficult to pick which one I was going to be on. But anyway, this side of the screen. 50,000 coins is our high alchemy price. So what that means for the high alchemy of 50,000 coins, essentially, if you buy this item in RuneScape, um, you can pay, you know, something around 50,000 with very, very little loss like risk. Um, here's the deal. When looking through the Grand Exchange and actually doing instant buying and instant selling and some non-instant buying, obviously, as you can see right here, I was able to, oh, sorry about that. I realized that you're not with me. <laughs> one second now you are so <laughs> it's okay all i did was scroll through here look in our elder room plate body right here i was able to buy these overnight um just testing them uh at fifty thousand three hundred and one each which is actually even less than it's currently showing for my instant sell it just it, it varies guys just just update it as you go um but i was able to buy them for fifty thousand three hundred and one each and then i sold them those exact 10 for 63,998. That is a 14,000 profit each on those plate bodies. And that may not seem like that big of a deal. Um, but if you take, uh, let's see, we take our 14,000 profit that I made on each one of those uh, times 100 because that's the buy limit on this item. If you did that, then every 100 that you buy of just Elder Room plate bodies is 1.4 million profit. 
If you did that for an entire day, that is 8.4 million profit you would make just by putting an offer in for these elder room plate bodies and then flipping them over to sale at 64,000 a piece. Something also too, as I get more into this and explaining more about what we're doing, um, Please remember that these prices are probably not going to be the exact same price that you see when you uh, when you do this yourself. Um, so make sure that you just check the price. Although what I can tell you though is for this specifically the elder and plate body, you're going to want to pay something right around this. You're not going to really want to pay like a whole lot more than this because this is the price that's right at that alchemy price. And the whole point of this is to be a safe, like super safe investment slash uh, flipping. I mean, even if you don't have like a smaller amount of money, if you have a lot more money, like for example, you know, there's max cash right here between these two. Um, if you wanted to like, I, I could do something like this. Let's go ahead and take this out for just a second. And I'll show you like in what this does. Elder rune plate body. Um, we got elder rune plate bodies. Let's say that I put in an offer for 50,301 each. Uh, you can buy 600 of them for every day. Uh, because it's a hundred per buy limit and there's four hour buy limits. So that means four times six is going to be 24. So that's 24 hours. That's one day, um, 600 per day. If we go ahead and do that, like, let's say 10 days worth, 10 days worth is 301 million. Well, what if I let these sit here for an entire month? So we just take that times three. So that's 900 million gold. So for someone who has a little bit more gold, or quite a bit more gold than the uh, kind of like recommended minimum I was talking about right there. If you bought these things up for an entire month at 905.4 million, and this is once again, this is one of the things that people don't always think about when they're talking about uh, long-term investing. And this is why long-term investing, your longer term, it's only, you know, this is only 30 days. It's not that long, but longer term investing can be really profitable um, even on such a simple item like this because we buy for 905.4, right? Um, and excuse me, there's people, there's people cooking in the background. That's why you hear a bunch of pans flying around. But, um, anyway, yeah, I'm, you know what? I wanted to, I wanted to get this video out to you guys so badly that I actually am doing this during dinner party. <laughs> so, Hey, Hey, hi everybody. Hope you really, I really hope you enjoy this video. Um, so 905.4 million is how much my purchase is. If I go by my, by my sale that I got, which was 64,000 a piece, um, keep in mind, you might be able to sell these for more. The mid price is 71,000. You can go try 71,000. It probably will sell. I mean, honestly, because Elder Room Playbody has been, you know, it's not a new item. So the, so the mid price must mean something. Uh, so that means that, you know, you could go get 71,000. Don't, don't stick to 64,000. Just to, just an example, because this is the one I have proof to show you, right? You get it? So anyway, you spent 905.4 million. The output is... 1,152,000,000. So that is a massive amount of profit, guys. That's a massive amount of profit. That is something close to 250 million profit that you could make on one month of throwing in an offer for Elder Room Plate Bodies and doing literally nothing else. Now, obviously, you know, kind of like we were showing where I just instantly sold it and it was 50,401. And you look back over here and it was... 50,301. That buy is going to fluctuate a little bit. Um, but with them having a little bit lower of a buy limit of 100, then it allows you to, you know, update your price a little bit less. The items that have smaller buy limits require less price updating. Then the reason why is because the person who is overcutting you or undercutting you can only buy a certain amount of them and then they're not blocking you anymore. You get it? Like, for example, if I'm offering 50,000, some other guy's offering 60,000, but there's a buy limit of one. Well, sure, he'll buy one and then mine will continue to buy. So for items like this, it's so, so much fun and so cool to do these like super long buys on them because of the fact that you can do that because that's a lower buy limit. But even with that buy limit, guys, almost 250 million profit from buying a solid month of these. Now, this is like perfect case scenario, kind of like I was just explaining with the buy limits and like people are undercutting and overcutting. This is like perfect scenario. And the thing is, though, is like chances are you're not going to get a solid 18,000 bought. Maybe you'll get 15,000 or 14,000 or something like that. I don't know. It, it'll, 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 it'll vary. And that'll also be kind of fun because I'll figure out how many you're actually going to buy. Now, just for giggles, if we actually sold these for the mid price, um, that would be a total of 1280. 1280 million and we only spent 905 so that is a insane profit if you sell them for mid price i don't expect them to go for above mid so we won't speculate any further anyway going into the next item here too by the way 
You get the idea of what I'm talking about with this video, though. Um, Elder Rune plus zero items, just in general. Uh, they are very great to, to buy up right now and to do this with because also the Yak Track just ended. And with Yak Track ending, a lot of people made the Elder Rune items during the Yak Track. Because if you remember, there was a task on Yak Track that said make an item of whatever or higher and elder rune items is one of the options you could do so people would actually make like stacks of these elder rune armored boots for example and make a whole bunch of those because they you can make like 109 of those per hour with all the boosts so that makes that means that making that task for for yak track is rather fast by doing the armored boots for example um what that means though is there's a lot more of them in the game right now and we can buy those up for this for this investment right here the thing is is as time goes on there'll be less and less in the game which is beneficial for you because whatever you're holding on to is going to go up in value it's going to return to what it was going to before also some some cool things i saw in here too by the way check out these elder room plate bodies or sorry plate legs so elder room plate leg if we go back over to our page so let's go back over to our page really quick window capture there we go oh yeah learning how to use learning how to make videos again so exciting okay so we're on this page right here let's go back to our item list and another reason why i would put this item list in the description down below is because that way you guys can just do some research and figure out what more items Items are out there just like the Elder Room plate body. If in in one uh, spot you are doing the Elder Room plate body, you've got seven more spots that you can use for offers. And so if you have if you have the gold to do it, then put in eight offers for these things. Don't put in one offer. Do like plate bodies, plate legs, armor, uh, gloves, whatever. Just find out what's good by using this list right here. Let's go ahead and take a look at these room plate legs, though, and we can get an example of, like, get an idea of how good these are. And my cat just really wants me to uh, to come and talk to him. Uh... There. Hopefully that will get rid of the cat. <laughs> so anyway, Elder Room plate, plate Legs, let's go ahead and jump on into it. Um, if we have these items right here, the High Alchemy on Elder Room Plate Legs is only 30,000 gold. And the reason why is because it takes three Elder Room Bars to do a, uh, a Elder Room Plate Leg. Now if we go back over though, and um, we look at Window Capture, and then we go back to our game. I don't, even, I don't know why I'm actually saying Window Capture, but anyway guys, we're doing this just like, we're doing this just straight up no editing and the reason why is because i want to show you how you i want to show you these guys how they literally work right now like this is real um elder room plate bag plate like plate bags uh they did not buy for one hundred forty thousand. but what i'm going to do is i am going to make sure we get an instant buy really quickly that way i can show you exactly what's going on with the elder room plate legs because it's pretty interesting and they probably have a pretty large margin that you can do overnight so we know that the mid price is 61.8 we know they cost three bars to make there we go. The instant bought for 225,000. That's absolutely insane. Um, hint, hint, you can go smith these yourself and they only cost 30k each to smith. <laughs> wink, wink. Extra bonus right there. Um, now let's go ahead and instant sell these and see what you could potentially buy them for right now. So they're potentially buying for mid price. Well, actually a little bit over mid price. But if we go to the sale history... You could flip these Elder Room plate legs right now for 64,000 or 65k basically to buy them and then to sell them is 225,000 gold. Um, that's insane. And the thing is though is you might be able to buy the Elder Room plate legs for the high alchemy value or a little bit above the high alchemy value. This right here is what you want to see though as far as this crazy ridiculous buy. And the reason why is because these buys like this are things that you could potentially be selling these elder room plate uh, like these elder room items for uh if if i'm buying them for thirty thousand a piece because that's high alchemy value and then i turn around and sell them all for two hundred twenty five thousand, i make like almost 10 times my money it's like eight, eight eight or nine times your money that is a ridiculous margin on this for something that you can potentially buy for something for like a price that you can't really lose money on if you're buying it for the high alchemy i would Honestly, risk it myself personally. I would risk it to pay the sixty-five thousand gold each because that's also right around mid price, which that mid price has been solid for quite a while, and then probably not going to just tank out for no reason. So the thing is, the elder room plate legs is that uh, you could buy these for mid price, and then you could try selling them for two twenty-five. The two twenty-five seems a little bit unrealistic though. So once again, just test things. I don't know if you'll get two hundred twenty-five thousand. <laughs> 
right and the next thing we got here is the Elderune armored boots so this is i want to i want to cover this one really quickly obviously we're going to get a little bit repetitive we went through th through every single item in this entire list but i want to show you guys one more thing before we end this video and that is the Elderune armored boots and the reason why i want to show you this one is because this one is extremely cheap they're only nine thousand a piece for the instant sell right now and it's also a pretty solid one because the instant sell is uh, 1200 below the mid price and it's also below the high alchemy the high alchemy on these things is equal to 10,000 gold essentially the high alchemy value is equal to however many bars it takes for you to make the item so Elderun armored boots sorry Elderun armored boots is one bar which means it's going to be a 10k alchemy al alchemy the plate body is five bars 50,000 the legs are thir three bars you get the idea so if you're trying to think of how much can I pay for this without, you know, like going over the high alchemy, just remember that that is how much is equal to it. it's equal to how many bars takes it. So the elder in armored boots, though, at 9000 a piece is ridiculous. That means that right now you could put an offer in to buy these elder rune armored boots at 9000 a piece and then you can sell them for potentially the mid price or higher. Um, and I, for an item like this, though, I would definitely at least try the mid price, even for those plate bodies, guys, try the mid price first. Like, just just try it. The one of the best things I can tell people is flipping or investing is not about how fast you can flip something. It's about how much money you can make when you flip something. So if it, so if it, you know, if you, if you lose one day because your sell didn't work, who cares if it would have worked, then you would have made so much more money. So test things first. Don't just, don't just be like, Oh man, I bought these boots for 9,000, bro. I'm going to sell them for 9,500. That would just be dumb. You would just, you, you, you would potentially miss out on 700 profit, or you can try selling these above mid price. And I would probably bet money that they would actually sell above mid price because once one more kind of note to remember about elder armor things, not very many people actually make these things and yet they are still a viable thing for some like you know less fortunate players to buy for armor uh, or if people want to buy them to upgrade them anyway guys that is pretty much it for this video as you can see i just kind of ran through a bunch of things here just testing things the elder rune the elder rune uh, round shields they didn't buy they're probably some ridiculous price uh pickaxes a ridiculous price uh elder rune 2h is ridiculous price the offhand uh, bought for sixty four thousand. The mid price is seventy one. That's you know, and and these these things you know, a lot less in bars. You can probably you can probably buy these. Also, this was an instant buy. Actually, yeah, here one one check one quick. I'm I'm actually super interested to see this Elderun offhand longsword instant buy for sixty four seven. I bet you this is probably a great example of something you can buy for right around the high alchemy price. It is. So you can actually buy these for 18,000. Okay, that's actually super interesting. Just real quick, w while we're here, let's go ahead and take a look at this. Um, if, if you guys are gonna click off this video at this point, uh, thank you so much for watching this video. But I just wanna, I actually wanna see what we can look at for how much we can actually pay for this. So offhand longsword is two bars, which means it's a 20,000 buy limit. So if we're looking at 20,000, uh, sorry, a 20,000 alchemy price. So if we have a 20,000 alchemy price on this, Boom, right there. 18K, boys, 18K, that's nuts. That is crazy. Now you can probably understand the reason why I was so excited to make this video because I saw this and I was like, oh yeah, this is great. Um, so Elder and Offhand Longsword, 18,000 buy price. The High Alchemy is 20K. That means you have zero risk. Quite literally, I'm dead serious. There is literally no risk when buying Elder Rune Offhand Longswords at this price because it's below Alchemy. It can't go lower. It's actually, if you buy it at this price, you can High Alchemy it for profit. But anyway, the Elder Rune Offhand Longsword, if you nonsense sell though, 64.7K, that is a massive profit. That is ridiculous. If you guys wanna see a quick calculation of how much money that would make, which I'm also very curious, um, Let's let's just do like a one day buy for you know just a quick one because this video is already really long but I hope you guys enjoy it. I know a lot of people are like, man, make longer videos. So I'm just I, I actually enjoy making longer videos. That way we can talk and figure things out. So eighteen thousand guys, we're gonna take that times one hundred, uh, and then we're gonna take that times six. So which is gonna require you to use ten point eight million gold, which is kind of like I was talking about in the beginning for those people that have ten million, twenty million, whatever. 10.8 million gold invested for one day of buying these. So one solid day of buying these. Um, and then we're gonna be able to uh, do, let's see, so 10.8, let's do the profit is gonna be, let's say 65,000 to keep it simple. Minus 18,000, our profit each is equal to 47,000 gold each, wow. Your daily profit, okay. If you quite literally 
took the Elder Rune offhand longsword that I just showed you, and you put in a buy offer for 600 of those, which is a one day buy, that will cost you 10.8 million, and you will sell those for a profit of 28.2 million. That's not the total sale of 28.2 million. Your profit is 28.2 million per day. If we take that times a month, if you did this for a month, it's 846 million gold. So in an absolutely perfect world where everything works perfectly and Jagex, you know, doesn't do any updates that we don't like and uh, everything is amazing with our RNG, um, you could literally start with 10.8 million gold on day one and you could have almost a 1 billion bank by day 30 by just doing Eldarune offhand longsword. So if anyone is like, man, these don't seem that good, Manti Gaming, then uh, yeah, I think you're probably smoking something crazy because 846 million profit, you can bet you I'm going to throw some offers in myself. Anyway, guys, I really hope that you enjoyed this video. I just saw this and I was like, man, this video, this this idea just reminds me of something that we'd be posting like early on in the channel when stuff was crazy and making all these crazy wild, uh, you know, finds that we'd find. Anyway, this right here also is our Discord. Um, I want to show you guys this really quickly. If you um, are not a member of our Discord, feel free to come join. Uh, this right here is our prices section where we literally put the instant buy and, I'm sorry, the non-instant buy and the non-instant sell. Like as you can see right here, knock scythe, knock staff, knock bow. If you guys are into flipping and stuff like that, the left number is how much you buy it for. The right number is how much you sell it for. And that is quite literally how easy it is to flip in our Discord. We have people that post all day long. This is all from this is all from today. Let me scroll up, see how far I can go back. All from today. Yep, still from today. Still from today. There you go. It, st it stops right, right about there. So all of that is from today for the prices that were posted in one of our four flipping sections. So if you guys enjoy flipping, you want in, you want literally exact buys, exact sells, then go check it out. The description down below shows you guys our Discord link, which you can join in. We have, by the way, we have almost 5,000 people in this group, so it's a pretty big group. It's not small. Um, our Discord link is down below, and you guys can check out the Patreon channel too if you want to be a supporter and also make yourself a few billion gold. It's kind of cool. And then you can also look down below for that link I was talking about for the uh, list of Elder Rune items. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. I really enjoyed making it, uh, and I am going to be making some more uh, stuff when I'm in the Netherlands, so uh, we'll see how... Uh, how good that quality comes out. <laughs> All right, everybody. Have a good one. See you later.